Hey there, guys. That is all of them. That is no toy. It belongs to Shang Tsung. We are finished. Return to your post. Stand aside. I will seek Katana. No one enters the tower. You are an excellent guard dog, Baraka. But you must learn to heal. I do not take orders from you. <laughs> I gotta love how that other Tarkadon was playing with that shotgun and just about blew Baraka's freaking brains out. Okay, boomerang, shadow kick, let's see. Okay, that's the pole smash boomerang. Boomerang that goes up when they jump. Oh, gee, it's not bad. Oh, that's a pretty vicious move. Come on, Baraka, work with me here. Stop freaking blocking and just... Ooh, nice. Little overhead pull flipping. What, he can shoot energy beams from his arm blades? Damn. Now I feel bad about not being able to play as Baraka in the story mode. Yeah, he's just kind of there as the thug who gets beat up all the time by every goody two-shoes there is. Poor Baraka. He never really gets a serious role. It's just always the goon who gets beat up. Sucks to be him. And it's like... What's up with his face? Like, can he not close his mouth or anything? He must drool in his sleep like crazy. Oh, crap. Yeah, we've seen this one like a bajillion times already. I mean, how often are they gonna have us fight Baraka in this freaking story mode? Crap, I messed up my x-ray. But at least now I know that when Jade does her x-ray, she rushes forward like a madman. And I really need to start getting some freaking hits in, otherwise this is not gonna end well. I mean, look at how much health he has and how little I have. I mean, damn. Okay, that's a shadow kick. Kinda dash forward and kick him. It's a pretty good move. Probably also very useful for dodging Shiva's freaking stomp. Please don't let us fight Shiva in this chapter. I have already had enough of Shiva for the entire freaking LP. Huh. Well, at least we made a nice comeback. Good boy. Uh, Adenians have no loyalty. Blind loyalty is not a good thing as I have learned. You must keep your eyes open to anticipate the finishing blow. What are you talking about? You make it too easy. You had not dishonored yourself, hey. My orders are clear. No one is allowed in the tower. As you can see, I am here. Here to help the princess escape. You would deny her execution? The only means of regaining her honor? We have very different concepts of honor, Shokan. Oh, for fuck's sake. Should have known we were gonna fight Shiva again. Yep, there it is. Splendid. I don't know what it is, but I just freaking hate fighting Shiva. It's mainly that move, probably. Well, it could have been worse. It could have been Goro. Who's kind of like Shiva, but even stronger and more overpowered. Luckily, Goro is not a playable character. He's only a boss. I mean, imagine if Goro was playable. That would be horrible. Oh, damn. Our X-Ray pretty much has a range of the entire freaking screen. Jeez. Can I still make a comeback? No, I can't. Oh, boy. And where'd Katana go? I thought she was chained to one of those statues. But she's nowhere to be found, and we're in the far right corner of the room. Yeah, that's about the worst position you could be in in this game. You do not want to be pinned in a corner, because then you'll pretty much have nowhere to go. And you really don't want that to happen. Trust me. Come on, stop freaking jumping her around. She was freaking agile for such a big creature. And there we go. Him in the spine. Yeah, I think we saw Jade's X-Ray already. Like when we fought her as Jax or... Uh, the Katana chapter? 
I don't know, did we see Jade's X-ray? I think we did. Yeah, nothing new there. Hell, I don't know if I need to make an X-ray montage after this LP, because I'm pretty sure we'll have seen all of them at the end of this LP, pretty much. Because I don't think there is one character you do not play as or fight. Except for Kratos, because he doesn't appear in the story mode. So maybe I'll show like Kratos' X-ray. But I am going to make a nice fatality montage after the LP is over. Which is pretty soon actually. Only 6 parts remaining because the story mode is 16 chapters. So yeah, which 6 characters could we be playing as? In the other chapters. Oh come on, no no no. Please don't kill me. Let's see, I still have my x-ray. Crap, she blocked it. Well, then we'll just smack her to death with punches. There we go, Shiva vanquished again. Not much of a jailer, are you? Now then, your highness, let us see how quickly we can remove these bonds. Jade, I... I am too. Go, find Raiden. Ask for his help. That should distance me from any pursuers. <gasps> Others pursue. I find. By the gods, you are Melina. You must return with me. There's to be a celebration for my sister. She's going away. God, I hate Melina's voice. It's so whiny and annoying. But yeah, that is a nice outfit she's got from somewhere. Although I still prefer that little bandage outfit she was wearing in the previous part. I mean, <laughs> nice. Except not that much on Melina. Why can't Jade wear that outfit? Or Katana, or even Sonya. Hell, maybe even Shiva, if you're into four-armed creatures. Maybe the Japanese are. Japanese tend to like some effed up stuff. Yeah. Oh crap. Ow. Wait, how did she get those... What were those? Daggers? She can throw them? Okay. Come on, just stand still for a moment. Melina is pretty annoying to fight as well because she is the fastest character. Every fighting game needs to have like this super fast character... And for Mortal Kombat, I'm pretty sure it's Melina. Crap. Come on, work with me here. I'm not gonna... Whoa. I can teleport all over the frickin' place. I don't think Jade has a teleport. Crap, stop blocking my bloody x-ray. Bitch. Come on, no, no. Throw, no. Crap. <sighs> okay. Looks like we'll have to finish this in round three. Stop with the damn teleport. Why can't I do that? Hmm, maybe I should try out Melina sometimes. I've played with some more characters I haven't played as an arcade today and found some pretty good ones. Quan Chi is actually pretty damn good. And Noob Cybot, he's pretty damn good as well. I don't think we've seen Noob Cybot yet, but I'm pretty sure he'll be introduced soon. Because... There's plenty of characters we haven't seen yet. I think there's about... Uh, a handful, like six or seven or something, that haven't been played as or fought against yet. So, still lots of stuff coming up. I mean, we still have pretty much the entire Mortal Kombat 3 segment of the story mode coming up. Including all of the characters that originated in that game, so... Yeah. I am more of a sister to Katana than you. I must find Raiden. He is here. Katana turns away from Shao Kahn, so you attack her rather than join her? This is not... Smoke, Kit stop! That is not Katana! You will come no closer! And Smoke is being a huge dumbass right now. I mean, what, is he colorblind? 
That would be the only logical explanation I can see for him mistaking Melina for Katana. I mean, if he can't tell the difference between pink and blue, then that would be the reason he would think that Melina is Katana, but if he's not colorblind, then he's just being a dumbass. Or he must think, maybe Katana put on some purple clothes today, but I'm pretty sure we haven't seen anyone change their outfit. Although Johnny Cage did. Yeah, he went from uh, from the tuxedo in the first part to like this. Ah, uh, just his pants. Yeah, some characters change their costumes, like from their alternates to their first ones or the other way around, but Katana hasn't. And Katana's alternate costume is also blue, because that's her color. M just like Melina's pink and Jade is green. That's why they were all recolors of each other in like Mortal Kombat 2 or 3 or whichever. Yeah, I think they introduced in those three in Mortal Kombat 2. And yeah, Smoke's X-Ray hurts my nose. Or the playable character's nose. Can I finish this with mine? No, because he jumps over it. And yeah, that invisibility still doesn't fool me. Pretty much shouldn't fool anyone. It doesn't fool the AI, because the AI always knows where you are. And it tends to not fool human opponents either, so it's just a useless move. Now... I win, and I will see you in the next part of Mortal Kombat. I did not wish to do that. Lord Raiden, I come at the request Lord? Of I was with Smoke. I thought she was a bad guy. Uh, girl. Guess he turned another one. What's Raiden got that I haven't got? Godlike power? A personality that is not at all like sanding paper? Jerks. Katana does not have much time. Katana? Executed? Where is she? Held captive in the tower of Shao Kahn's fortress. I will... I'm not pleased with this outcome either, Liu Kang. But there is no time. We must return to the tournament. But you are responsible for her capture! You persuaded her to turn against Shao Kahn! Lord Raiden, we can free her as others fight in our stead and join you thereafter. Very well. Meet you at the Coliseum.